Hey guys, so it is Monday, the 16th of November, and today is the day I start my weekly vlog. So hopefully I will do a little snippet of each day. Um, I've never weekly vlogged before, so bear with me if it's mega long, I'm sorry, um, because I'm used to just rambling all day. Um, but I'm just going to have to like record like little bits of my day and then just take out what I feel is necessary. Um, I broke out so, so much. That's the first thing. Second thing is I look like this because I did a night shift last night. So yeah, and it's 5pm. Um, I woke up like at like half two or something. Um, today Jonah woke me up and then I was like right I need to get up now because otherwise I'm just going to end up sleeping all day um, and then we went to Morrison's picked up a few bits um, so yeah um, I don't really know what to talk to you about to be honest um, um, I had today at work I did some training um, I'm just watching Shan Exil's vlog um, I filmed a video yesterday, let me show you it. I really liked it, it was Kylie Jenner inspired. It doesn't look like um, a tra traditional Kylie Jenner look because I don't know, I find there's a lot of them out there. Um, but I filmed this and I found a picture of her like with that sort of makeup. I spent ages filming it, I was really happy with how it came out and it all corrupted. So I'm fingers crossed that my camera's not just pissing around and just fanning about because that would be awful um so yeah um all i'm doing at the minute is just i'm just gonna chill until probably like like eight o'clock or something and then i'm gonna have a bath wash my hair just chill out and then um jonah's back at 10 um and then tomorrow um well i'll vlog tomorrow obviously um but i've got some stuff to do tomorrow um i've got two days off now it's so it's so weird like doing i did so many hours over winter time and now like my hours are pretty much done so i only do like very little hours in the winter so that's good but i mean like this shift killed me today i was so tired um because it's like three hours traveling on top of my shift as well so i've been up well i was up from 9am on Sunday all the way until like 10am today um, so yeah um, my hair feels like really dirty I keep straightening my hair and I'm like right I'm gonna film that hair tutorial and I've just not got around to doing it uh, but I am going out tomorrow so fingers crossed I will have chance to film it um, fingers crossed but I might because what I've been doing, I've been filming a makeup look and then doing my hair after because I don't want to have my hair done and my makeup not. So um, I want to do a video with makeup and then do my hair on top of that. Uh, but I've been filming a makeup video and then just like waiting for my camera to charge, editing that and then just not having chance to film again. Um, but I have been filming a lot recently. Um, I think in the four days, I probably filmed like six times or something. Um, I've got a video going up. I think I might put it up today actually, let me check. Um, I don't really have set, set days for when, you know, um, I put my videos up, but yeah. Um, I've got a blue winged liner makeup look, that's 113. Um, I'm going to be putting that up. Um, I think I'll put it up today and then I'll make sure I have a video ready for... I'm, I want to try and do it like every other day but I'm not promising anything. That's why I've not set a schedule because I don't want to start doing that and then letting you down. Um, so yeah, um, the makeup look I want to do is on the starting freelancing vlog. Um, the hair look, sorry. Did I say hair or makeup? I don't know um so yeah that's the hair i want to do so hopefully i will film that tomorrow uh, but i um, i want to film a makeup look as well so i might i, I just don't know how it's going to work i've got two days off now so i will get it filmed in these two days i promise and then hopefully that'll be up 
what else is going on there's a lot that's going on at the minute uh, that I can't talk about um, just because nothing's set in stone nothing's um, been talked about officially or anything <sighs> so yeah um, I've broke out so much my skin hates me but I have been filming tons so and I've just not had a chance to do any face masks or anything so when I have like I'm just gonna have a girly night tonight like just chill out um, and what I'll end up doing I'll have a bath wash my hair put my hair up and just leave it to dry um, or I might blow dry it and straighten it again so then it's ready for tomorrow um, and then I'm probably going to do my nails and then I'm going to put a face mask on and a pour full, uh, pull in mask a pull dirt mask whatever you call them I don't know um, so yeah um, I think that's it for now so I'm just sat here drinking a chocolate milkshake because it's cold and chocolate milkshakes are good when Jonah gets home tonight we're gonna have just for, we're just gonna have fajitas um so yeah um just doing something really basic um we went round to Jonah's mum and dad's yesterday which was really nice um and we had tea there um, where they made curry it was so good um so yeah, anyway, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Bye. People are going to be like, what is she vlogging? I like I like cinnamon ones. So. There it is. What about that vanilla one? It's all right. I like that one. Mm, no, I still prefer the vanilla at uh, the cinnamon. cinnamon. Purple mango. Cinnamon. Tango tree. Oh my god. <laughs> candle plate as well. Singing candle eight pounds from the glass jar. Yeah. Right, no problem. All right, thank you. Thank you. What's on here? Put these there for I love jewelry, you know, but I never get any. Is it? Yeah, I think it's just dripping. Yeah. Huh? 
started to rain. What's this? I want um, a burger. Yeah. Just hot dogs here. Huh? Just hot dogs here. Of course the rain kicks in. Him? Of course the rain kicks in. Why? These all look good, Jonah. Cover all them up. And come shy. Expensive than that, wouldn't they? Oh my god, look at all this.
<laughs> What's that? That's nice. Yeah. The big cabanos, the green peppercorn, the lanyegi just tried, the mini chili, the Christmas pate, the hazelnut and the chorizo, all for just ten pounds. I like chorizo. Chorizo. Uh, chorizo. Chorizo. Uh, in the fridge we can freeze them for up to a year. Hazelnut. Do you not? I think it's nice on salads and that. Oh yeah, in salads it would be really nice. But like but when then, people get it on butters and stuff. Too much of it. All them goodies. Chocolate. Better there. Okay. Do we want to get any more notes? No. Why? I'm nutted out. Are you? Yeah. Oh, I'm not. They are nice, warm. Oh, that guy doesn't have those glasses. No, so it's quite a that one there. Like, great time. <laughs> yeah, but I'm vlogging. It's terrible. Me and Jonah just got interviewed. You should go back to the woman interviewed and start interviewing. I know, yeah. <laughs> so, what are you doing at university? Do you like it? And what university do you go to? I should have vlogged it while I were there, shouldn't I? Yeah. This woman um, interviewed us to see if it's like reality at Christmas for people to find love and what we thought on it. And we both had different opinions because obviously women like like they have like the true romance. I think like, we have love the same story. opinion. But no, I mean like with like women they have the fairy tale, don't they? Like yeah. with um, like watching Christmas films, like that's the fairy tale of it, and that's where I think girls get the idea. Um, but I think with guys, they sort of just love comes along when it comes along. Like, were you looking for love when you found me? No. But I wasn't looking for love either. Looking for a quickie. Oh my god. <laughs> now look where we are now. Vlogging at Christmas. It's still November. It's not Christmas. <laughs> Too much? Goes right to the back of your throat, you know. Inhaler moment. Sorry, I'm just having a severe asthma attack and you're flogging it. wonder if there's any elephants on here. Hey, <laughs> hey. You're embarrassed. I've just got to like proper reach my arm out. Happy Christmas, Mum! <laughs> Let's hope she don't watch this one. She knows what we did, I don't think she does. Let's ring Ryan. Ring Ryan off your phone. Yeah. Hey guys, so it's Friday the 20th. And oh, oh. Say bye bye to me, Thomas. Because it's doing off now. I would, after I've done this, I will do tracks, yeah? Um, so I'm just at Rose's and me and Harry are waiting for Mummy to get back, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, you excited? Yeah. Me, my, me and Twister boys. I... So, yeah, uh, Rose's at the... Uh, <gasps> Bruce is gone! Are you draw Brucey then? No. No? You've ruined my Brucey. Um, so yeah, we're waiting for Rose to get back. She should be back probably about one-ish because she's at the Cosmo Blog Awards. Uh, so that should have been fun for her. Um, 
So, yeah, um, so I'm just at Rosie's looking after Harry. Sorry I didn't vlog yesterday, obviously Dad. it's Thursday, I... <gasps> is that Rosie? No. No, what is it? That's a cartoon. A cartoon? Yeah. Um, yeah, totally Dad. forgot about vlogging, I was on a night shift. <gasps> That's so good. Um, so, yeah, I didn't vlog, I was on a night shift. Dad. Just finished a night shift tonight and now I've got four days off. Well, four nights, three days. Wow! You're so clever. What's that? What is it? It's a cartoon, isn't it? It just draw Thomas. Oh, yeah. Shows you how to draw Thomas, doesn't it? Um. So, yeah, anyway. um, I haven't heard Did back from... Thomas? Do you want me to draw Thomas? Yeah, I'll draw Thomas. Um, yeah, um, yes, I did a night shift. Now I'm off for a few days, so that's good. Um, um, I don't know what I'm going to do after this. I've got, I'm going home, and then Jonah finishes at art. Why are you going home? What? Why are you going home? Why am I going home? Yeah. Do you not want me to go home? No. Okay, I'll stay. Am I going to move in? Yeah. Should we ask Mummy first? Or do you make the decisions around here? Hmm? Do you make the decisions on Mummy? Just, just um, Mummy and you and, and me. So <laughs> it's going to be me. This and mummy and Harry. and Harry and Bruce and Bruce. Wow, that's a house full. So Rosie, I'm moving in apparently. Um. Anyway, um, I will talk to you guys in a bit, and I'm gonna play with Harry now. We're gonna build some tracks, aren't we? Yeah. Okay. Can I have a kiss? Mm. Oh no, not Tom. <laughs> Give me a kiss and then, and then what we're gonna do? We're gonna play your your game, aren't we? Kiss, kiss. Mm. Oh! <laughs> kiss again. Mm. Oh! <laughs> we'll see you guys later. Say bye. Good morning guys, so it is, what's good afternoon? It's two o'clock in the afternoon. Um, so it is Saturday and oh, it is day three of moving. Um, I don't think I've actually mentioned that I've moved, I'm moving. I mentioned on Tuesday, I think that I had some news and the news is I am moving. Um, there's a lot going on and there's a lot to do. Um, there is snow on the ground outside my house. Not fun. But yeah, I'm moving. So I'm going to show you each room of movement. <laughs> so this is the first room. Obviously, I've just got my clothes here. These are stuff that I will be taking. Um, and obviously everything on my desk like all my makeup and then i've got makeup in my box here so yeah and then i've got in the end room i've got stuff i'm selling the bathroom's pretty much empty stuff that i'm selling in here so these are going to the charity shop um clothes and everything and i've got desks and shoes and lots of stuff like that and then upstairs i've just got my bed which will be going as well that'll be going in the bin <laughs> So it's a stressful, stressful time at the minute. Um, we are moving to Jonah's parents' house, which seems so weird because I love living on my own. Um, I um, <laughs> we're looking forward to it. We're both looking forward to it. Um, it's we've got to this point where. I mean, I was going to move to Manchester this year, but 
then I met Jonah and obviously things change and I'm not saying Jonah's holding me back in any way but I'm just saying like I weren't going to leave him uh, but obviously you know I work at the airport my job's up there it's a lot for me to travel up there that's why I'm always so tired <laughs> um but um we are going to be moving to Manchester next year because Jonah will be going to uni up there um so we need to save for a house up there because it is so much to pay up front for a house and then we want to have money ready for well we're living there and it's going to be nice we'll be living with his parents for about seven months or so um it's going to be different because i've never lived with anyone apart from when i was 16 um you know i've lived on my own since i was 16 and it's going to be weird going back and a lot of people have questioned it like are you going to be okay with that and i'm a pretty easy lot person to get along with to be honest it's definitely going to be weird for me to move in with someone that i've never lived with before and um, it's going to be weird for me living with people again like it's so weird um, but we're looking forward to it because we're going to be able to save and we're going to be able to do things through the seven months that I've never been able to do like I've hardly ever been out in my senior years um, just because I don't have the money to I am not you know I don't I have money to cover my bills but I don't have money just to go throwing around on you know like going out every weekend or going on holidays or anything um so yeah it is going to be nice to spend that seven months being able to enjoy seven months of us not having to pay loads of money out um it does cost a lot of money to run a house if you want to move out then all you know you go for that but it's an expensive journey um i've had a lot of help on the way and i've done a lot for myself this year i'm very proud of where i am this year i'm on the doorstep of my career and i can't go any further in my career it costs a lot of money to start um training um and i don't have that money there i don't have the money to save yet so moving in with jonah's parents is going to help me us both um me save for my career us save for ourselves and save for um moving so we've got you know we've got a lot of things to do when we're there it's going to be a different environment but i love jonah's parents i love his family they're so sweet and so easy to get along with um it's going to be obviously different when i'm living with someone but yeah i think my nan and granddad are back they are, so I'll talk to you guys in a minute, bye. Hello guys. So yeah, my nan and granddad have just left anyway. Um, oh, take my shoes off. I can't believe how slippy it is outside. I packed up like the shoes that I don't wear on a daily basis to go to my nan's. Um, and then I was like, I saw my snow boots. I was like, I kind of need those now. Um, anyway. Um, yeah, I'll show you the living room. Right, so. This is my... So, this couch is being sold. It does come to pieces, like, two separate there. And obviously that's separate. Uh, so, that's being sold. These are just boxes. All that corner was full of stuff that's gone to my nan's to go in her loft for when I move back in. So um, we'll be starting looking for houses in about January. And this sort of stuff's going to Jonah's parents' house. So we don't really, I don't really have that much stuff. This fridge I need to sell as well. My nan's having my washing machine because she wants it. <laughs> um, There'll be stuff that I will be taking from my kitchen, like all everything in the kitchen will be going being wrapped up. So like I mean food, my nan will take. But I mean like stuff like this. I've got a lot of like cups and everything. Um 
Then I've got like a lot of electricals down here, like tea towel and bread maker and all that. And you know I'm a baker, I love baking, so all that I will be keeping. It will be going to my aunt's and it will go in her loft. Um, they're gonna make loft space in there. Um, it's just like my spice rack, and my pans that I'll be taking from the kitchen because I love baking and I'll be baking all the time. So yeah. Anyway, um. I'm going to, I'll show you what I made yesterday. I made these yesterday. So they're Rice crispy and Hershey S'mores balls. They were supposed to be rolls, but they were so sticky. I was like, I'm going to change them into balls. Anyway, um, it's now half two. I'm going to be picking Jonah up at... Um, four and then at five he'll go back to work and um, then I'm going to go to TK Maxx and buy a coat because I don't have a coat for the winter I do have one coat it's a Michael Kors one I'm not big on Michael Kors to be honest so I am not trying to show off with that but it is a nice long coat and obviously I am very short, so it goes to like here on me. And it's not good for like when I go to work because I've got nowhere to put it. So um, I'm going to go to TK Maxx and get a new coat. Because um, I need like a big warm coat. You know the coat Jonah always wears? Don't know if you've watched my vlogs before. But the coat Jonah always wears is so warm. And um yeah, I need to go and buy a coat, like seriously, because um, I don't have a coat for when I'm going to work and everything. It's so cozy in this corner. So yeah, I need a coat for work because I freeze my tits off when it's I'm set off to work at half three, half two in the morning. I get f so cold. So yeah. That's what's going on at the minute. I am moving house. Um, it seems so, so much, but it's gonna be so good for us in the long run. This um, is a step to get to the next step. Um, if we don't do this, then I would have to get another job on top of my job now. And that isn't possible because the hours I work are ridiculous and um, my shifts are <laughs> death like they kill me um so yeah anyway i'm gonna be doing i'm gonna write down some stuff in this book um i need to write down some video ideas and everything filming wise i won't be uploading as much these next couple of weeks because i'm moving and i'm gonna film tonight because we're going out tonight we're going to Nino's for a couple of drinks with Jonah's parents, so yeah. Um, look at this giant spot. So Rosie gave me this face mask last night, and it's for oily skin, and obviously she doesn't have oily skin, so she gave it me. And I had a spot like rising yesterday, and it's one of those like lump spots, really deep in there. And I put that this mask on last night, I've also got on there and some on my forehead. So yeah, this mask like draws everything out, like your pores and everything like that, dirt and everything. So I think it really helped it this morning, it's brought it out. No, everyone's like, everyone's always like, oh my god, I've got a spot. And it's like, that's the benefit of spots, like you can see it coming out, like the dirt is coming out your face. So yeah, that's why I have this massive thing on my face um so yeah anyway i need to put some of my furniture on gumtree so i'm gonna be doing that now and i've emailed the people from my camera i'm gonna check my email now but they didn't recognize the um they didn't recognize um the name of the camera or anything so yeah i sent them a picture of it so and they're taking the piss to get back to me which is kind of really annoying because i really need this camera sorting it's not my fault it's 
going all tits up and corrupts all my files on my camera, not on my laptop. So yeah, anyway, I will talk to you guys in a little bit.